This video will walk you through the steps of using MLA Style with IRSC Library Resources. These resources will take you from format to works cited and help you create a perfect MLA paper. The Modern Language Association's MLA Style is used most often in English and history courses. MLA allows your instructors to quickly see where you incorporated information from outside sources into your paper. It also ensures that you do not plagiarize, which is a serious academic offense. To begin citing an MLA style, go to irsc.libguides.com MLA. This will bring you to the library's MLA resources and has everything you need to create your paper. Click on the Formatting Your MLA Paper link at the top of the page. This page provides information about MLA's requirements for font, spacing, and margins. This page also includes an MLA paper template that is ready for students to download. We recommend this template over the one used in Microsoft Word because it was created specifically for IRSC courses. You can download this template as many times as you like. Once you download and open the template, you can see that it provides an example of an MLA heading, the body of your paper, and your Works Cited page. You can type your own work directly into the paper template or copy and paste your already started paper by using the Keep Text Only Paste option. Now that you have your template downloaded and ready, you can use the LibGuide to create your Works Cited entry and in-text citations. Remember, each reference requires both an in-text citation that signals where you used information from outside sources within your paper and a Works Cited entry that provides additional information about each source. Hover over the Works Cited Examples link at the top of the page to select a source type to view. I'm citing an article from IRSC's databases, so I'll click on Journal Article near the middle of the list. This page gives me examples of database sources that I might need to cite. For example, if I would like to cite a scholarly article about Averroes for Emily that I found in JSTOR, I would use article from a scholarly journal in a database, no DOI. This means that there is no digital object identifier listed on the article. You can also see that the column to the left shows an example of your in-text citation for the same source. Sometimes sources might include additional information that you should include in your citation, like a timestamp for a video or an edition number for a book. Hover on the Works Cited Core Elements link to see all of the elements of an MLA citation and examples on what to do with each element. You can also hover over the in-text citations link to see more information on in-text citations, examples of different types of citations, and guides on paraphrasing and quoting both poetry and prose. Other resources available in the MLA LibGuide include a downloadable annotated bibliography template, and an MLA quick guide that you can print out for reference. Once you have finished your paper, click on the Submit Your Paper for MLA Review link to have a librarian review your paper before you turn it into your instructor. Remember, it takes about a business day for a librarian to respond with comments, so make sure you allow yourself enough time for a librarian to give you feedback. Need help with other MLA questions? We are here to help. Email library at irsc.edu or check out irsc dot libguides dot com slash ask a librarian for more ways to connect. <laughs>